Shiba Inu. Whales amass over 223 billion tokens amidst price drop. Hey, Shibarmy! Welcome back. Make sure to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon. Let's get straight to the point. Shiba Inu whales bought staggering 223 billion tokens, despite price drop to 6%. This surge in intrigue among Shiba Inu community. So if you are a Shiba Inu fan, stick around and watch complete video to not miss on single second. According to Watcher Guru, the cryptocurrency industry had quite the weekend. However, all the assets seemed to be recovering. Shiba Inu jumped in on this trend after crashing to a low of 1,830 cents. Amidst this chaos, a whale address decided to make the most out of the latest drop and scooped up 223 billion SHIB tokens. A prominent whale managed to beef up their Shiba Inu holdings with the recent downtrend. About four of these deep-pocketed addresses that were on a shopping spree in the last 24 hours were discovered. The first move was discovered when a whale address snapped a whopping 107.1 billion ship from Coinbase. The purchase was made right after ship dipped to a six-week low. This further highlights how the transaction was a strategic maneuver to leverage the discounted price. Right after this, another new whale emerged and went on to carry out several transactions. The whale acquired billions of SHIB from Coinbase. It should be noted that the tokens originated from the same Coinbase wallet that was part of the earlier transactions. This further hints at a deliberate accumulation strategy. Following this, a well-established whale jumped in to explore the waters. The whale pocketed 13.7 billion ship tokens. Right after this, another whale purchased 29.6 billion tokens from Coinbase. All these whales were clearly on a mission to capitalize on the market downturn. Crazy part ahead. Stay tuned and make sure to smash that like button. Amidst this whale activity, Shiba Inu recorded a 6% rise over the last 24 hours. The asset, at press time, was trading at 233 cents. It looks like this sentiment will endure throughout the week, and Shib is projected to surge to a high of 3,188 cents later this week. According to TradeBite, a prominent crypto analyst, the ship price dropped 52% to 21.75 cents, but now all eyes are on a falling wedge pattern. If the price breaks a certain level, it could potentially shoot back up to 456 cents, representing a significant increase from its current price of 2,353 cents. Looking ahead, Changely has made promising predictions for Shiba Inu's price in the coming year. Based on the price fluctuations observed at the beginning of 2023, experts expect the average ship rate to reach 341 cents in April 2024. Experts expect the coin's minimum and maximum prices to be 245 cents and 437 cents, respectively. With this we come to the end of this video. Shibarmi Jibe, huge likes to this video to grasp the YouTube algorithm. Have a good day. Things went completely wrong. Shiba Inu is falling in price super fast. But what is going on? Why should we be afraid? And what does BlackRock have to do with all of this? Well, let's find out. Today brought an unexpected turn. The crypto market crashed. And now, many are feeling frustrated, particularly the paper hands investors who recently entered the market, selling their positions at a loss. Shiba Inu, despite its recent bullish news, took a dip too, likely due to the Bitcoin dumping. And let's not forget how closely Shiba Inu mirrors Bitcoin's movements. But here's something people might not understand. The recent Bitcoin halving event did bring excitement, with expectations that the Bitcoin price
coupled with the entire crypto market, would start booming right after. Historically, this has been true, but it doesn't happen instantly. As one Twitter user explains, incredible how people think the halving would automatically send Bitcoin to $200, while in fact, there's a six, nine month lag period for the price to start appreciating. What this means is that after a Bitcoin halving event, where the reward for mining new blocks is cut in half, it typically takes about six, nine months for the price of Bitcoin to start rising significantly. So while there's excitement around the event, the full impact on the price isn't immediate. Historically, the halving has been good for Bitcoin's price only long term. In the year following the halving events in 2012, 2016, and 2020, Bitcoin's price increased a lot. However, in the month following the halving events, the price changes were either small or even negative. This data suggests a pattern. The market reacts to the short-term impact of the halving, but tends to underestimate its long-term effects. But anyway, why did the entire crypto market crash today? What's the reason? Well, today, BlackRock's Spot Bitcoin ETF registered its first day of zero inflows. After 71 trading days in a row, right after the approval of Bitcoin ETF, it made people question how it is possible. And that question makes much sense. Like, literally zero. Why is it not a number? How can it be zero? It's a valid question, because zero inflows, after consistent positive activity, raise suspicions. Zero typically signifies absence. But in financial terms, it's rare to see absolutely. No activity, especially after a significant event, like the approval of a Bitcoin ETF, so, what does this bet mean? Well, it is a very Semba trading spin, and it prompts people to wonder if there's something more going on behind the scenes. Ever since its launch on January 11, BlackRock Bitcoin ETF has consistently attracted investments worth millions of dollars daily, racking up nearly $15.5 billion in just 71 days. This inflow streak ended for BlackRock on April. 24. After it recorded zero dollars of inflows, it was believed by a lot of people in the crypto community that Bitcoin would be the first ETF to set a record for consecutive inflows in history. History. Imagine how crypto enthusiasts would feel, eagerly anticipating each day's inflow numbers, only to see it suddenly come to a halt. The hype it would bring to the crypto world would be immense with discussions and speculations flooding social media platforms and online forums. While the lack of inflows is a first for BlackRock's Bitcoin ETF, it's not uncommon among other ETF participants. Fidelity, for example, has notched three days of zero inflows in the last two weeks. But still, it makes people feel sad that the streak was broken. Anyway, this 71-day streak puts BlackRock's Bitcoin ETF among the top 10 funds of all time by yet. Another measure. If you're curious, the longest inflow streak ever recorded by an ETF was 160 days, attained by JP Morgan's Equity Premium Income ETF. But still, this is not the reason Bitcoin. Price crashed today, making other cryptos follow. So, what is the real reason? Well, as we've kind of gotten used to already, Grayscale Bitcoin Trust ETF continued to bleed. On April 24, Grayscale recorded $130 million in outflows. As a result, the spot Bitcoin ETFs realized a net outflow of $120 million on the day. It's pretty interesting how the inflow streak was broken, but Grayscale is still there, keeping dumping their Bitcoin. Additionally, today, most of the other Bitcoin ETF participants witnessed a dry spell as well. Well, this is one of the reasons the crypto market crashed today. If Bitcoin goes down, since it is the top cryptocurrency and carries significant weight in the market, it pulls all other cryptocurrencies along with it. When Bitcoin experiences a significant drop, 
it creates a domino effect, causing other cryptocurrencies to also decrease in value. But don't worry, as it looks now, there's actually a light at the end of the tunnel. Shiba Inu is in a fragile state, as many of its key growth metrics are contrasting amid a broader bearish rebound on the market. As of right now, the price of Shiba Inu has dropped by over 8%. To contradict this bearish slip, there is an apparent boost in trading volume, which has soared by over 12% to $800 million. And now, this situation may look surprising to some people, because typically, when a cryptocurrency's price drops significantly, there's a corresponding decrease in trading volume as investors become more cautious and less active in trading. However, in the case of Shiba Inu, despite the price drop, the trading volume has actually increased. This contrasting trend raises questions and intrigues investors, as it suggests that there may be heightened activity or interest in Shiba Inu, despite the bearish market sentiment. Per data from Shiba Burn, a major boost might be coming for Shiba Inu's deflationary feature, as the burn rate is now relatively flat, at 0% growth, the meme coin saw 22 million Shiba Inu incinerated in 24 hours, setting the stage for potentially interesting developments. Shiba Inu is one of the top altcoins whose actual growth is highly impacted by slight tilts in key metrics like burn rate, trading volume, and large transactions. Before this derailment in price, Shiba Inu had initially flipped the 26 price level as support and was primed to reclaim the final top 10 crypto asset spot. The ultimate goal, as recorded over the past week, was to reclaim the next point in its broader market. Shiba Inu's price growth can be boosted by the tokens embraced by its community's whales. At the time of making this video, data from InterTheBlock shows that large transactions have soared by 61% in 24 hours to $162 million. Sustaining this massive embrace can help restore the accumulation of the Shiba Inu that the token sellers sold off. Besides whale transactions, another important trend to watch is the general trend on the broader market. As discussed earlier, the spot Bitcoin ETF market leader, BlackRock, has seen a break in its daily inflow streak. This showcased that the broader bullish sentiment driving the market, investor sentiment, might be dwindling. And here's where things get interesting. Leading crypto exchange Bitmart has launched a window to allow Shiba Inu enthusiasts to buy Shiba Inu tokens for a 30% discount.